Hi, I'm Francis, a year 4 computer engineering student and I'll be graduating this July. Studio Cloud is a virtual reality drawing game that my team and I made during a hackathon. We designed Doodle Cloud to recreate the experience of lying on the ground, uh, looking up in the sky. So when you don the headset, you will see a blue canvas and um, a word will be given to you as a prompt. From there, you will use your finger to draw shapes in the sky using clouds. And depending on how well you draw, the game will match the word to your drawing and it will score accordingly. So for the Shanghai Hackathon, we were given the theme Cloud, just one word Cloud, so it's pretty open and broad. We drew a mind map of words that were related to the Cloud and also ideas that were related to the Cloud. What came to mind immediately was um, the physical Cloud, also uh, ideas like Cloud Computing, but we didn't want to be so obvious, so we tried to incorporate how we interact with Clouds. So when I say interact, I mean when we look up at Clouds and we imagine things that are not there, so this is unique, unique to the clouds and this is something that we really wanted to, to drill into our project. So when designing to the cloud or any virtual reality experience, you want it to be a natural for the audience. So when you're looking up in the sky, you don't really use a controller and draw. We wanted to use hand tracking to allow the experience to be more natural for the user. So another key aspect of the game was um, recognizing the drawings made by the user. So after you do a, a drawing, the drawings get sent to the Quick Draw API by Google and we'll get back a response, basically a, a prediction on how close your drawing is to the given word. And from there we can give you a score. When we presented the uh, idea to the judges, the judges were quite pleased at how well we used the theme cloud in our project. Yeah, so at the end of the day, we won. <laughs> For the whole experience, I felt that um, it was very fulfilling because we got um, the exposure of travelling overseas, meeting other people who are in the industry already, and also representing Singapore was, was pretty cool. And I think going to the competition, we were very much the underdogs being the smallest team. And also, the competitors were quite experienced in this field. It was quite daunting at first, but when we heard of the results, we were very much surprised. With what I've learned here, I want to continue to explore emerging technologies and how they can be applied into different use cases. So these use cases might have already had some solution, but I want to explore how the current technology or the future technology can further improve on these methods or experiences. When you apply to uni, I feel that it's not so important to think about how much you're going to earn at the end of the day. I also think about what kind of uh, impact you want to make on society as a whole with the degree that you earn. For those who are coming to any computing, I believe one thing that can help you thrive is uh, a passion for tech and a passion for learning. I believe that a passion for tech can always be nurtured if you, are, if you don't feel yourself to be so. And um, lastly, be prepared to do a lot of googling.